KGAB. All right, we're back to the phones. Good morning. You're on In the Morning Zone. Hey, Dave, this is Barry. Hello. How are you? Well, you know, having to deal with some federal government red tape this last week. I haven't called. That's the reason why. Um, you know, Dave, um, the problem we have with the government, and I want to mention with the black boxes first, you know, I have an issue with the black boxes that are one of them put in the cars, you know. With those things, you know, they can track you. They want to charge you the taxes and stuff. And what's happening is we have a government that is no longer looking to capture, um, you know, or, you know, criminals. They want to make criminals of everybody. Well, certainly, uh, you know, they're going about it uh, a strange way, um, you know, by inserting themselves into almost every facet of our life. You know, and, you know, God gave us natural freedoms. You know, he gave us the freedoms. And, you know, what the government has given you, he can take away from you. And, you know, God gave us the freedoms, and so the government can't take that away from us. Now, I understand when you stand up for liberty, there are consequences, but when you do stand up, God will move. Indeed, and more and more people, I think, are standing for liberty, for well, sure. we definitely have to be against those black boxes in our vehicles. Yes. I know they're, they're coming, um, ultimately. When they started putting them in airplanes, we knew it wouldn't be very long before they put them in cars, because somebody would think up a good idea, a good reason for it. Oh, well, gee, it could uh, monitor uh, the number of drunk drivers on the road. It could uh, tell us what caused an accident, etc., cetera, etc., cetera. Uh, but that's not really what the problem is. One of the things I do find out about bullies, and it's proven fact that 98% of all bullies, when you stand up to them, they will back down. The th problem we have is we have too many people that just have not grown a pair. And, you know, and Dave, we need to have more people that are willing to take God at his word, mm -hmm. willing to stand up and say, you know what, God? You know, Dave, I had to deal with a bully here a while back with something. And, you know, I went right in there. I said, you got a problem? And, you know... Right then and there, you know, the, the man, you know, he said, oh, I'm sorry. You know, I didn't realize it made you mad. But, you know, we have to start standing up. And I'll be honest with you, Dave, a year ago, I wouldn't stand up. Now I will because it's time that we have to stand up. And, you know, even though it's fearful, we have to do it and learn to say the word no and trust that God he'll back us up. You got it. Thank you, Dave. You bet. Thanks for your call.